Yes, I'm recording. Whoa, I'm starting the vlog. Hey, I'm Ghostface and I'm gonna kill Eli. Wow, now we're just, we're, no, sheesh. And we're back at another convention, second one of the year, I think, pretty sure. And we're at a new con, Mad Monster Party, with the famous Calcifer Bacon, the famous Onyx, and yeah. The we're famous going, Eli. The though. famous Eli, and we're just going to go look for horror stuff, make some friends, probably not, no one likes those. Did you show the snake? And get content, and we're going to find a snake. Yeah, there's a real snake. So yeah, uh, I don't know what to say. Get ready for some epic horror stuff. Yeah. Oh, we saw Nev Campbell. Yeah, we saw Nev Campbell. So that would be inserted as well. And yeah, cue the montage. conversations with Matt and Tyler. They really gave me a lot of confidence uh, in their work. And I had seen Ready or Not, which is, you know, I think it's brilliant. Um, and they really spoke about their love for Wes and how they became directors because of Wes Craven, um, how they made Ready or Not because of the screen films. And you can see the influence. Um, so I felt good about them. And then of course, going in, it was very exciting. Um, how long? How long were you actually on set for this for this time? I think I was in um, around three weeks. Yeah, not the whole time. Now I'm gonna jump back really quick to for those of you who haven't, heard, those out there who haven't heard before, like how you first auditioned for became a part of Scream and, and taking on the role of Sydney. Uh, I auditioned, you know, because um, I had never been a lead in a movie in the states. Um, and so, you know, I, I had read the script and thought it was brilliant and was asked to come in and thought, I'm sure I'll come in. And I went through several auditions, I think probably three callbacks, I think, from what I remember. Um, and then finally went in and did the screen test with Wes, which was a phenomenal experience. I mean, it was, he's, his energy was um, very calm, very confident. He knew what he wanted very clearly, um, and he was able to, to express that and communicate that really well. And so it was a really, it was a nice, actually a really nice audition, um, a nice pro creative process with him. One of the great things about that movie is that the chemistry between... So, I just kind of wanted to ask if there was anybody in your life that maybe uh, influenced you or something that you idolized that made you want to make that uh, giant leap to becoming a... I guess a, a like a main movie star in those big movies. There was someone in my life who, who inspired me to become a movie star. Is yes. that what you were asking? Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's any one person. It was just uh, falling in love with cinema. Um, as a, to be honest, I was a dancer before I was an actor, and I was really influenced by uh, the great ballet dancers that I would that I would witness and I'll also train under in Canada. Um, and like Fred Astaire and Jim Kelly and Ginger Rogers and those old school dancers, you know, I was I was really moved by their entertainment. Um, and then honestly, I grew up, my dad uh, used to take me to review cinemas and I grew up seeing foreign films like Babette's Feast and Leolo and Cinema Paradiso and like a lot of really incredible foreign films. Um, and just, you know, I've witnessed a lot of great art and and, and I, yeah, I sought to, to find that kind of artistry or that kind of um, genuine, grounded work. Uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you. Look at all these banners, guys. That's so cool. We're Spirit Halloween. <laughs> Lake Hickory Haunts. Cool, cool, cool. It's the ugly people that uh, have the good life. They just stay ugly. They don't got nothing they need in life. 
Comment down below what's your favorite horror movie. Mine is Midsummer. Have you seen Midsummer? No, I have not. It's on the bucket list. It's a very suspenseful movie. First booth that she already bought and stuff. She she owes me like five dollars. <laughs> Bag. Don't you owe me money too? No. Dang, y'all all just buying stuff. You owe me money actually. You owe me like ten thousand dollars, I think. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me. Then buy it. Buy it. Buy it now. The X -X -X? Yeah, I'll buy it. I don't know. Ooh, I want this. I want the sickle. Ooh, a knife. Whoa. What is that? A knife. No! Oh, oh, yeah. Deal. Mm -hmm. What you buy? Oh, Lord have mercy. Can't take you nowhere, you inappropriate kid. No. It was but it was like $21. It's Cthulhu, guys. Cthulhu. Shoot, I'm gonna have to get me one. Shoot. Oh, it's Boba Jason. It's Boba Jason. These are all kind of cool. Shoot. Shoot. Dedication. So tall. Oh. I love it. Are you gonna spend more money already? I was supposed to get a t-shirt. First rule of the con is you're supposed to walk around the whole entire con, look at everything, then you buy. First thing you saw, you bought. But well, that's only when you're here for like multiple days. Nah, nah. First boot, bought something. <laughs> wow, wow. What can I say? Mm -mm, go home. Look at all of these killers. I need to cover my hat. <laughs> Oh, this is my cosplay, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. Eli, cosplay for you know, Mad Monster. I'm a, I'm a counselor. Heck yeah. I got my little whistle and everything, Ooh. you know. How hard was it to find this lanyard? It took a long time. It took, <laughs> I couldn't find it online, so it took me a month. I had to go to multiple places. Dang. 40 miles to Whoa. get this. I it's mean, worth next, it. <laughs> next day they had it at my mall. Of course. I was like, wow. <laughs> How will life work? Yeah. Life. Nice. What did they do to you? <laughs> Snow White. What they do to you? What is this? What is this? These two are from Monster High, so I get it. <laughs> oh, I just I threw love up. The head, the baby doll. Head. Uh, I threw up, but I got a mask on, so it just uh, it's everywhere. When you when you see the booty. <laughs> If it just have different kinds yeah, of things, <laughs> nightmarish stuff. Oh, oh, Rocket, what did they do to you? <laughs> no. Oh my God! Look at the, look look at the snake. <gasps> oh, that's nice. oh, that's so cool. Oh, I love the snake. <laughs> How old is the snake? Two. Okay. Wow. It's the Gremlins. I've never seen the Gremlin movie all the way through. Pain out here already buying some more stuff, some tarot cards. Absolutely. Little stickers. We're just out here with the camera. We're like, okay, so what are you buying? <laughs> Your favorites after yesterday video. Yes. Yep. Everyone wants to know who you are now. Hey, look, guys. It's uh, what's what's the uh, rock that Elmo has beef with? Rocco. Yeah, Rocco. <laughs> Elmo is Rocco. You're just a rock, Rocco. <laughs> Lord. Yo. I'm gonna get my. I'm gonna get a, have a kid, and they're gonna. This is gonna be their favorite little plushie. She's gonna give that to the straight up. Yep. <laughs> Grow. Second version of the cosplay right here. Bucket hat edition. I 
could do a second one, and instead of cargo pants, I could do the short shorts. This one has the blood on it, so do one without the blood. Yeah, I might do a second version. This is the hat. Wasn't you supposed to dress up like a camp counselor too? Okay, well, I changed my mind and now I'm Freddy Krueger, but like, yeah. Man, can't take you nowhere. Half because my legs look fine. Okay, so back to the <laughs> regular broadcast. That's not creepy at all. That's not creepy. Uh, this is what happens when you have like you uh, peeling the skin off your uh, finger, and then it keeps on going, and it goes all the way up this to your is face. What I look like when I take my makeup off tonight. Yeah. Ew. Yeah. This is what you look like. But they say what they mean raw. <laughs> Ew. Ew, you nasty. Just like three days dead, right? Yeah. In the dirt. In there for a minute now. Oh, this is so cool. That might be the next cosplay. The mask. Have you ever seen the mask? Alright, just making sure. You're a little culture. Sadly, the second one. I'm more culture than you. You've barely seen any horror movies, sir. Whoa, don't be calling people out like that. You remember? <laughs> Yeah, I, I left my abortion anger over there. I didn't I'm a child and feed you to my family. Oh. That's, he, cause he circumcises it. And then he wears my foreskin. Don't touch me! That's what she says. You my daddy? No. You wanna be my step bro? No. What are you doing to me, step bro? Oh no, are Lord. You stuck in the <laughs> yeah, I stuck, I stuck under the table last night. No, no. You know, <laughs> Lord. <laughs> yeah. Jesse. What happened? <laughs> Sheesh. Look at, that. Look at the feathers. So, what do you think so far about your first horror movie convention? I think it's awesome. And I like the dealer's room a lot better than any dealer's room at an anime convention ever. So. It's unique. Like, all this stuff is very unique. Yeah, first horror convention, yeah. Only convention she's been to a horror one. No. She's a whore for horror. I've been to most of them. I've actually been to this one multiple times. Oh. Like five years in a row. Oh, wow. you're a whore for horror, okay. <laughs> wow. So we're gonna put her in a horror movie and we're gonna kill her. She's the scream queen. <laughs> Met Elvira, you know, Mr. Something. Comment down below if we should do a short film future and on it. Yeah, a horror short film. Ooh, yeah. Where I die. Yeah, yeah. That's the happy ending. Yeah, we're gonna kill her at the end. Yeah, but you're not gonna know how to the end of the movie. Yeah, comment down below. It's the one, the only, the legend, John Williams. This man, he be orchestrating crazy. Yeah, this man orchestrate like crazy, man. And he's gonna orchestrate Obi Wan's he's theme song. The inside of the shark. He's in. That's Jaws. Bro, and he still ain't quitting his job. That's how, yeah. Man, man, and Superman, Christopher Reeves. Sheesh! I might have to get, get that. But no one ever comes to my house. No one would see it but me, so probably not. It's Monokuma, the greatest horror anime character ever. If you ever want to be scared, right there, Monokuma. Whatever you get, you eat. Eat a worm. Do it for the prize. Do it for the clout. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Well, eat it, eat it, eat it. Uh, no. Alright, I'll do it. <laughs> wait. Really? Wait. Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh boy, there he is. You gonna really eat a worm? Worm. Yeah, worm down your throat. Worm right there. Oh. You're gonna do it for real? I don't know. There's so many cameras. On. Do it. You already, you already committed now. I need to find out. I get a prize. I get a prize. Oh. I get a prize. <gasps> All right. Oh lord. It's not the worst thing I've done. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, uh. Eat it! Yeah! <laughs> it was swallowed whole. <laughs> She's a whore! 
She just ate a worm. <laughs> First time at a horror movie convention. Major prop. I just do it again. Got messed up. Right. You have to do it again, pal. Congratulations, you murdered the worm. I did it. You're going to hell now. You're a murderer. Watch this. It lives on. I've been tortured all day. It's up to I thought I'd put it Thank you for allowing me to burn it in the snow. Gregory, no. <laughs> she killed Gregory. <laughs> So how do you, how do you feel? It was really slimy, but I just like swallowed it down like a pill. <laughs> First time at a horror movie convention, and you just ate a worm. I didn't think I you was gonna do it. <laughs> how do you feel? Is your opinion about her different now? She's like I don't want to be friends with her. No, no, she's a strong woman. I respect her more. Than I respect. <laughs> now you have something wiggle up your, out your booty when you poop. You <laughs> <laughs> Lord, so you gonna eat a worm next? No. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Not with these tummy issues. Well, technically, you could eat something other What a legend. What a. Hey, look, we're at an anime convention. Oh, yeah. Hey, turn up. The Eye of Agarmoto. Wanda You don't know nothing about that, Scrub. I could be Wanda. You don't know nothing about that. Oh, yeah, you probably have mental issues like her. <laughs> Guys, it's Appa. Yep, yep. And look, it's Goat Simulator with the tongue. I don't even know what these are. It's the worm. It kind of looks like you look. Which one? The worm. Who are you going quit? Dang, that looks just like you. Like, stand, stand right here. My next hair to it. is not blue. Dang, you dyed your hair blue. Oh, yep, yeah, that's that's an icon right there. Lord. <laughs> There's Monokuma. Oh, they even got some Neo bits. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> Tentacle kitties. I kind of want these tentacle kitties. Oh Yo, God. I have never seen these, but these are lit. Oh, Yo, I might have to. Damn, this is how I'm gonna oh. die. <laughs> this is my oh. thumbnail. <laughs> oh. Poor Eli. That's in the chat. <laughs> Alright, they're buddies. All you have to do is really talk to Jason and then get him on the kill. Yeah, look at that. Let's get him some pizza. <laughs> Hey, there's a kid back there. You go, you go save her. Go save her. Fuck them kids. Uh oh. I think. Oh no. Why you stop at me? His name is Mr. Happy. Poor little girl. What you just do? I got Curtis He's bigger. Oh. She got an autograph. She's a happy little beaver. Yeah. Oh. Blushing, you just can't see it. <laughs> oh, she wants to cry. Now I gotta throw this and burn it to ruin your dreams. You want my autograph too? I'm kind of famous. No, Eli, you're not. How much your autograph? What? I'm right there. But what you do if you saw all this? They'd be like, "What the hell? How the hell?" <laughs> Where's my mom so I can make her hold it? No, I ain't a worm. She ain't a worm. Yo, look at this cosplay. These cosplays are getting crazier and crazier. <laughs> yo. <laughs> you could get tattoos out of con, guys. Like, yo, that's so cool. All types of tattoos. They don't do that. Yeah. Anime, Legos. I'm gonna get a tattoo with your face on it, okay? Okay. Bet. <laughs> my face or on your face? Yo, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> On the uh, cheek. <laughs> That's what I was saying to do with Betty White. Like that one. Will of Fortune. <laughs> That's a way better spin than what I did. Oh, we got the same thing. You can pick any of the colors. Oh, look at this hoodie, guys. Whoa. Oh. So you got it for me? Appreciate you. Yeah, I got it for you. Oh my gosh. Ooh, there's a puzzle. I want to build a puzzle. Yo. That's going to be the next vlog. Puzzle with a stranger. I'm going to find a stranger and we do a puzzle together. We got a 40 horror simulation day. We're going to do that. 40 a solemn experience. There's a ghost in there. Plot twist. There's only one person in there. <laughs> There's no person beside her. So we did did that. How was your experience? 
so scared. I'm Look at my eyes. Check out the Woods of Terror booth. Okay, thank you. You like haunted places? Yes. You can possibly even apply to work there if you want. And also, you can eat a worm and win a free prize. Oh, she already ate a worm. I did eat a worm. So, what you think? Oh, you crying. You okay? <laughs> Oh. Happy tears, happy tears. Oh, she got scared. She almost died. It's okay. No, no. Okay, come out, guys, for the asylum experience. All this horror stuff right over here. More horror stuff right there. All right, all right. I got, I got y'all. I got y'all. I didn't. You're asking her what's her favorite the horror movie is. Ghostface meets Ghostface. Ooh, sparkly Ghostface. There's always two killers. <laughs> I swear, if Ghostface, Ghostface pulled up to me with that outfit, I don't even know how I feel. But, uh, hmm. You can just kill me. Yeah. It's fine. Alright, three, two, one. Fuck. There we go. Better. Couples who kill together stay together. Oh, that's her camera. <laughs> Get it. Squad. Oh, my knees. Ah, I'm old. I love it. Love it. I I wonder. Nah. It's a little penis. It's called a chill. It's a little chill. Eli, you don't need to buy one of these. You already have one at home. <laughs> I told you that. No, you did not. You said me. No. <laughs> Alrighty, so since you guys are dressed up as Scream, what is your favorite scary movie? Um, Pet Cemetery. Pet Cemetery? Probably Fear Streets. Fear Streets? Scream, duh. Scream, alright. <laughs> Silent Night, Deadly Night. Okay, I haven't seen that one. Original Pet Cemetery or the new one? The original, hands down. Word, okay. We got some good answers over here. Alright, thank you guys. So the place is about to close. We on a Sunday. There's a lot of stuff to check out and stuff. Onyx been for like 800 times. Yeah, she's been like 800 times. This is her first time at a horror movie convention. And we're about to end the vlog. What was your, how did you feel about your first con experience? It was great because I ate a worm. You ate a worm? you never done that in any anime. Nope, never. Wow. What about you, your fifth time? Oh, oh, oh. Something's happening. this queen over here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You see this queen in purple behind me? There's a queen in purple right there. She's a queen. A goddess. A goddess. Great con. <laughs> Great day. Woo. And yeah, I don't know what else to say. So, I guess, peace oh, out. We got another oh. queen right oh. here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We have another queen. Goddess. Look at her. <laughs> I'm living for this. Alright, I think that's all. Alright. No more goddesses walking around. Alright guys, we're peace out. Till the next vlog. Weave out a horror movie out or slash it out. That dude looks like Steve Horror. Peace out. <laughs> Alright, so the con's almost over. This is my second attempt to closing this vlog out because I was filming and turns out I wasn't filming. And whoa, just pulled out something out of the sleeves. Wow. Content, content. How did you enjoy your first horror movie? It was, it was great. Because I ate a worm. Yeah. yeah. This is not scripted, guys. Not we scripted. didn't film this before. And didn't it already all... say the Yeah. yeah. <laughs> How about you? Oh. It was great. It was great. We saw many great cosplays, many killer clowns that displayed. That is all I have to say. And then there's the still person right there. Yeah. And I don't know what else to say, so we're going to peace out, weave out, and yeah. Bye.
Oh, oh, you can pop in, photo ball. <laughs> Second outro right here. Bye. And bam.